Yes. This is, and I don't want to take it out of the plastic because the plastic is completely sealed and you, uh, I don't want to take it out. I want to show how that it's brand new. Summit Mountain Picker. Yo guys, it's CJ again in the eBay room. So, um, no picking items today, so we're just going to talk about a purchase that I've done um, to put online. And then I got a, a cool little surprise here that I've also got that I'm including in my uh, eBay business or my e online business. I don't want to call it just eBay business because it's not all eBay. A pretty good bit of it is, but not all of it. But anyways, so if you're into the X Games, if you're into... Uh, I don't know, uh, going outside, hitting the half pipe, um, is it half pipe or half pike? I think it's half pike. I'm not sure. I don't get into that stuff too much. It's cool to watch. I don't know really the whole lingo, but I got the cool items for you. So first item is a Rockstar Energy um, bag. So this is... I guess it's basically a suitcase, but you can carry anything in it that you want. It's got the uh, carrying handle here where you can carry it like that. It's got the handle there. It also has a pull-out handle, but it's uh, embroidered with Rockstar Energy. So Rockstar there, Rockstar there, and Rockstar on the back. Now these are not items that I'm showing you here that you can buy, just go buy in a store. These are all promotional items. Uh, so basically you can only get this through Rockstar Energy. Well, you could. I don't know if you even can get it through them anymore. But uh, so, you know, these are all one of a, almost one of a kind items. Matter of fact, it's pretty hard items to find online that for selling. The bag well, was a little easier, but these next two items were difficult. So the next item is a skateboard. So this is a brand new skateboard. I've never sold a skateboard online before, so um, I'm really uh, hesitant and uh, trying to do the best I can with it. I don't really know much about skateboards. I don't know if they make them in different lengths, different widths. I'm sure they do. I know they make long boards and regular skateboards, but man, I had a difficult time. But anyways, it's really cool. On the back side, it's all the Rockstar branding with Flip 52 wheels. Um, and Ace, I guess these are trucks, right? Um, so, uh, brand new item, pretty cool. The wheels roll really good. I've, uh, somebody was telling me, uh, hey, check the wheels. Show us how well the wheels move. That tells you how good the item is or the skateboard is. So, um, I think it's going to be a decent item. Um, the next one is the uh, Grand Finale. Uh, well, let's wait on the grand finale. I have one more item. Now, this item is not a rock star item, but <clears throat> I'm going full on uh, outdoor um, uh, sports here, you know? So, this is a hoverboard. Um, this is an open box new. So, I've got, I've removed the hoverboard from the box and I've gotten it out. Of course, I didn't ride it. If I, were, if I wrote it, I probably wouldn't be making this video right now. Or if I would, would be, it'd be from the hospital. Matter of fact, all these items I'm showing you right now, if I would have tested it out, this video would be coming from the hospital. But um, I got it out. I looked at it I've, and uh, checked it out. It's in really nice condition. Um, you could tell that it's never been used before. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I, I think it's a pretty cool item. I don't know how popular they are now. I know at one time they were the hot item. Everybody was wanting one. And um, I don't know if everybody who was wanting one got one. Um, so, but I'm pretty excited about it. I think it might be something that may sell semi-quick. We'll see. I mean, is it something to put on, put on eBay? I don't know. I don't know if any of these are really good items to put on eBay or online uh, that way. Um, but the next item I'm excited about, I've so never sold one before. I've sold similar items or accessories that go along with it, but I've never sold it. So, it's this. 
This is, and I don't want to take it out of the plastic because the plastic is completely sealed and you, uh, I don't want to take it out. I want to show how that is brand new. Um, but it is Rockstar brand snowboard. Uh, it doesn't have the bindings, but it has the holes for the bindings. Um, it has the Rockstar logo there. It says Rockstar Energy Drink up there. And then it says the size of the board, which is a 156 down there. Down on the back side, it says Rockstar. Um, yeah, I think it says Rockstar. Yeah, it says Rockstar all the way up and down. So i um, super excited about that. Um, it is a high ticket item for me. Um, at least I hope it is. Um, and like I was saying, I've never sold a snowboard before. I've sold bindings. Um, and I'm not even sure if those are snowboard bindings. They may have been ski bindings. Uh, I'd have to go back and look. It's been a minute. Uh, and I was, I've also sold skis. The one thing that I am worried about is that the skis that I've sold, I've had skis with bindings and skis without bindings. The skis with bindings, I've sold semi-quick. They're both gone. Um, sold them, they were out the door, and uh, uh, we're pretty happy with those buys. The skis without bindings, I still have and I've had for a long time. Now, there's a lot of people watching watching them online, and you know, um, and they're they're up there in price a little bit, but they're still here. You know, they're I haven't sold them, so I hope that is not the same reasoning with the snowboard my next problem with the snowboard was again so like i was saying these are all promotional items so there's not a lot out there you know you can't just go and buy these from the store um i couldn't i could find the bag online i couldn't find a very similar skateboard online i found one that's semi close to it i couldn't find the snowboard at all um i could find monster brand so promotional snowboard but i cannot find a rock star one so price wise i am winging it um i think i have a good idea i kind of went off of the monster one a snowboard and you know monster rock star they're both good brands a lot of people like them um in my mind monster may be a little bit better of a brand i i, I see that out there a lot more and i see people buying like the hats with the little monster logo on it and stuff but no rockstar is pretty cool too i've seen ta people have the rockstar tattoo if you get a tattoo of a rockstar energy drink more likely that is a good brand so those are uh those are the items i have for sale um now i, I do want to put out there let me know what you think so my idea is to put them online individual um, but also I've been thinking about putting them on market a uh, Facebook marketplace combined and do local pickup I can't do uh, it's hard doing local pickup uh, where I live because I live up in the mountains as you know summit mountain pickers I, I live in the mountains uh, but I do get some hits on Marketplace. I've sold stuff and people have come and picked items up from me before on Marketplace. Um, the issue is, is I'm trying to get the most money as I can out of it, of course, right? And because I have a lot of money into them. Now, this buy, uh, these, I don't have, it wasn't just these four items. I had a few more items. I'm not showing them because they're simple items. It's like a Elvis Barbie, which I've s showed online before and I've sold before. Matter of fact, I can't show it because I've already sold it. But I wanted to show these big ticket items. But again, I have a lot of money into these items and I'm hoping to get a lot of money back. Um, so I know combining them, typically you don't get as much money. You know, it's best to sell things individual you you make more money that way um so but again you know i want to i want to i'm conflicted i want to get it i want to move it quick but i also want to make my money so you know put a comment down below if you're watching this video what do you think is the best is it selling an individual or is it putting it on marketplace or is it both um in my mind i'll just do both i'll sell an individual on ebay or and i'll just combine it and put it on marketplace as one lump but, uh, you know, I guess there's people out there who skateboard and snowboard. I mean, there's similar things. But, I mean, I think technically, you know, if you snowboard, that's your sport. 
you know your sport may not be skateboarding and snowboarding so i just don't know how uh, the best way to move them so um again put a comment down below what you think uh, i'm more excited i'm very excited to see what you have to say about that uh the next thing that i have is a personal thing to me um i absolutely love it it's my new thing it is my new business card so i have not had business cards in the past so uh, the story goes like this. So, uh, what I've been using for the whole this whole time is a ink printer to do my uh, shipping labels and also to print my packing slip. Um, well, finally, I decided to move over over to a thermal labeler. One one main reason was I started I was getting abundance of packages. Uh, now, truth be told, that has slowed down as of lately. I, I, I don't have the 20 plus, plus packages a day. It's dropped down to about 10, uh, 8 to 10 to maybe 12 at best. Um, but I think that has to do with school starting back up and such. But anyways, um, when, I was, uh, when I was getting like 20 plus packages, printing off a piece of paper and then cutting that piece of paper down to size and taping it to the package was very cumbersome um, it, it took a lot of time um, to do one package uh, and you know we were steadily running out of ink and you don't know you're running out of ink until you run out of ink um, or you're you know right there and let's say you know it's the middle of the night it's you know 10 o'clock at night you're doing a bunch of packages and all of a sudden you're running out of ink but you got to get the packages out the next day what do you do I mean what we were doing was we were buying multiple pieces of uh, mo multiple things of ink and storing it and then you know as we ran out we would refill it but that's a little expensive right so anyways I went now to a Dymo thermal labeler and I absolutely love it it is so quick it prints out the 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 stickers um, are a little expensive but they go a long way man I've I've had the same role for a while now and I keep on going oh I'm about to run out and I look and I'm like I still got a good bit I can still make it to the next time I need to buy some uh, to be prepared but um, it's gone a long way and I've used a thermal printer for a couple weeks now um, so uh, then once I got the thermal printer my issue then was packing slip so I've always put a packing slip in with my uh, the items somebody has purchased and now it's like I can't do a packing slip with a thermal labeler I guess I could technically but I think that would be a big waste and it would be small uh, small letters and such on it so I stopped doing packing slip but I wanted to put something into the package to one try to uh, let uh, have people go towards buying stuff from me more um, I wanted to promote my my YouTube videos and uh, things like that and I wanted people to understand you know what I what my level is with um, eBay uh, which I have right there which I'm a power seller um, I'm not a um, I'm not the top um, just because it's hard to get packages out from my house daily um, I have to do a two-day delivery um, two-day shipping so uh, that hurts top rated seller but I'm okay with that uh, anyways back to what I was saying so I don't want to do do a thermal label and us uh, for my uh, shipping label and I don't and then also an ink label for my shipping slip so I stopped doing the shipping slip so then my next thing was what what do I put in there to show appreciation to promote my store and promote everything else I have well I went with the card so now every purchase somebody makes I put a card inside and I put a sticker on top so I've done this for a while I've had these stickers for a while I just slap a sticker on it kind of promotes my store and such but um, it's not you know I, I like the stickers I love the stickers but it never it doesn't go as far as a card you know uh, when you put a sticker on a um, box yeah it was uh, nine times well, probably five times out of ten somebody's not even gonna really pay attention to that sticker um, some people may but and that's my hope is you know some will 
I'm, I'm not expecting everybody to, but when you put a card in there, somebody's going to grab the card, they're going to glance at it for a second, and they're going to say things like, oh, that's the store name. Uh, maybe I should go on there and see what else they have. Oh, they also do, he also does YouTube. Let's go to his YouTube and see what it's like, you know. Uh, oh, he has Instagram. Let's go uh, check out his Instagram. You know, that's, so a card goes a long way. Not only uh, does I feel like a card goes a long way for purchases and I can slip it into the boxes, I also could carry some around on me. So, you know, I've been out and, uh, been out in the, uh, out at stores and stuff and you know uh, talking to folks and people will be like oh yeah you know do you have this certain item in your store well and sometimes I do and it's like okay yeah go to my store let me tell you this long drawn out website you need to go to to search for my store well now I can just hand them a card it has the website at the top and you know maybe they'll check out my other things that I do so anyways uh, that's the cool things I have uh, going on um, if you're interested and if you do any snowboarding skateboarding you know uh, anything like that come check out my store um, it, you know the link is in the description for my eBay store uh, if um, and you know don't forget to comment on the in my video to tell me which way you think is best individual online or lumping it together on marketplace well, I guess that's technically online too, but mark, uh, lumping it on Facebook Marketplace or selling it individually on eBay. Or if there's another um, another electronic um, website out there e uh, online that these items would sell better on, let me know. Uh, I'm absolutely interested in that. I need to start uh, venturing out away from eBay and Facebook Marketplace. I mean, right now I'm probably... 95% eBay and 5% Marketplace. So um, I know there's others out there, Poshmark and Etsy and all that. I just I don't know what they're what's the best thing for me for those stores. So um, let me know the, what you feel is uh, what if there is other electronic stores that I can put this on. I'd be happy to take a look at those. Uh, but again, guys, like always like comment share subscribe uh click that notification bell and uh you know what i always say buy from ebay buy from me and i'll see you next time bye guys